Hey guys, today I will be opening slash reviewing the Aquion LED Mini Bow 2.5 Desktop Kit Aquarium. So right now I'm going to open it and like show you everything and then in a couple of weeks or so um, I'm going to be doing a review and it's going to be on the same video and yeah, so I hope you guys like it. Um, it looks like this and I got the white one as you can see here. Okay, so let's just go to the very back. So this is like a review of everything that it has inside. It says that the kit contains a sleek low profile hood with LED module and feeding hole. Um, so that's that. The Mini Bow 2.5 Aquarium, which is the whole thing basically. Um, a quiet flow power filtration. Um, the elevated base right there. Uh, the premium tropical flakes and water conditioner sample. So basically that. And an illustrated setup guide pretty self-explanatory on the side here it just says what type of filter it is so it's the quiet flow aquion's patented filter technology runs quietly and efficiently keeping water clean clear and healthy as led technology um, the lighting adds bright soft light to your aquarium environment and then here just three tips to success on the other side basically just says where you can put it bedroom office living room it's easy to set up creates a relaxing environment and simple to maintain wow that's great this is what i see when i first open it so it's the top um so yeah here's the led lighting and stuff i don't know what that okay um let's take it out carefully bottom is that how you do it? okay I think I think that's how you do it I'm not sure okay so things is the instruction manual which I'm probably not gonna be using okay here's part of the filter um I think this is the filter cartridge let's see what's this stuff setup guide huh. I can get some coupons. Great. Water conditioner. I already have this, so. And tropical flakes. Wow. There's lots of meal in here, so. Yeah, if you're not looking for that, then don't get this. Um. I don't know what this is. Oh, I think this is the switch for the light. Um. And then, <laughs> and then these two things, this is like the thing that goes in the water. I don't know what that is, but we are going to find out when we put it all together. In the instruction manual, it has the installation and operation. So step one, check filter for any signs of shipping damage if damage do not operate in return. Well, looks pretty, looks pretty good to me. I don't really know what way it goes, but whatever. Remove cartridge from bag and rinse under cold water to remove carbon dust. So I'm gonna have to open this and then put it under cold water. And then we're gonna install the cartridge as shown using orientation rib to position correctly. Okay, um, this is how it looks. Okay, this is what it looks like in the thingy. Wait. No, no, it's not. <laughs> this, this is how it looks. Okay. Step four, install filter in tank as shown. Filter catch must mount as shown. All right, so let's turn this tank around. Okay, so it goes like this. Oh, hey, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I did it. Can you see that? Okay, I did it. Um, fill tank with water one inch from tank's top edge. So, okay. Um, plug power cord into household. Okay. Filter will begin to draw water from tank. Pump water into filter through cartridge and return it. Let's try to put this together. I think this part. Go. <laughs> Here? Yeah. Here. Oh. Ugh. Okay, that's weird. And then, um, this part. 
somehow manages to get in there. Okay, let's try taking this apart. Can I just get it in there or do I have to like snap it? Oh yeah, it's a snap. Okay, it's just a snap. That seems like the easiest thing ever. Let's open the cartridge now. Usually I would rip it, but since I'm on film, I don't want people to think I'm uncoordinated, but you've already been watching this video, so you know I am. Okay, so I've never worked with filters before, so I don't really know what to expect. It seems pretty self-explanatory to me, so basically you're just gonna put this part on this way, and then you're gonna put this part on uh, that way, and then you're gonna put this part um, on, nope, no, not that. Okay, let's see what the picture says. Okay, so it says that this is the orientation rib, but I don't really see that anywhere unless this is it, but, um, okay, maybe it is. Oh, 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 this thing, this little dent. Okay, and then... Right? Cause, yeah, that fits perfectly. Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. Okay, where does this part go? Oh, does it bend? <gasps> oh my god, I did it. Okay, I'm not gonna put the whole thing in though because I'm obviously not ready yet. And we're going to just simply connect these two like so. And then we're gonna plug this in. So I'm just going to plug it here. <gasps> oh my god. Do you guys see that? Oh, it's amazing. Oh my god, look how many scratches it has. Okay, so then it would simply... Okay, and I'm assuming this will just go like that or something. There we go. Let's turn this bad boy around. Oh, ah. Oh, I hate that sound. Okay. Um, please go over there. Please. Go over there. Please. Okay. Just stay on. There we go. Wow. That was so easy. Okay, I think that's it. Try turning it off. Ready? That's amazing. That's... Wow. That's so amazing. Baldwin is going to love his new tank. Alright, so now I'm just going to clean everything out and set it up. And if you guys want to see me set it up or how to set up a beta fish tank, then just check out my video that I made on it. And yeah, so the next time I will see you will be in a couple of weeks when I am here to do the full review of the Aquion Mini Bow 2.5 tank. I don't even remember what the name is. Alright, so later.